All right, so today I'm gonna to be showing you guys how to bypass Google's FRP, uh, which is factory reset protection. This is my method. Um, yeah, you're gonna need a couple of different things. You're going to need one, a phone with hotspot. You see, I've got mine on right now and it's connected on this side. The second thing that you're gonna need is a uh, Bluetooth keyboard. Um, not all Bluetooth keyboards are going to work. This is one from Samsung. I find a lot of the accessories for the Samsung devices, like from Logitech, they have, you know, the function that allows them to work. But, uh, yep, yeah, I'll have, like I said, the links in the description for it. So, first thing, you want to connect to the uh, Wi-Fi network, which we've already done. And right here, oh, another thing, too, you definitely want to take out your SIM card. If you have your SIM card in, this trick is going to uh, not necessarily work. Um... And you have to reset the phone again if you want to bypass it on some phones. Not all phones, but a lot of Sprint phones, you have to reset the phone again. All right, but anyway, so now you got your SD or your SIM card out, and you got your hotspot connected and your keyboard ready. What we're going to do is just hit next. Essentially, eventually, we're going to turn off. <laughs> we're going to turn off the Wi-Fi when it says uh, software update after checking connection and all that stuff. So let's just agree. And I'm doing this behind the camera, so I might go slow. But we will leave it on until we see software update. Bam. Now we turn off the hotspot. And what happens is it can't sign in. So for some reason, it just starts to bypass it. And that's pretty much it for this phone on the side. We're just going to bypass by going this way. And yeah, we can skip all of that nonsense. And matter of fact, no, turn the hotspot back on. Definitely want to turn the hotspot back on. So we'll turn that on and we're going to wait till we see it's connected on this side. Skip anyway, because you're going to need it right about now. So it's going to reconnect itself. Let's just hang tight. All right, now we're back connected. Uh, so, yeah, I guess you can go into, like, the privacy policy. And then we're going to scroll and just long press a word. Then we're going to share and uh, just hold that takes us right into the settings for it. Um, now, if you have certain phones, like on Root Junkie's video, you can go into data usage and hit that and watch his video. It's the same thing for the most part, but with a different method, different twist, because this phone doesn't have the check data settings. So uh, I can't do it his way. But my way is by force stopping the setup wizard. And what happens is now we can actually pull down the notification bar. Before, if you would have tried to pull that down, it wouldn't have worked. And, uh, yeah, next, we're going to, I think I know who that is. Anyway, next, we're going to um, turn on Bluetooth on both ends on our keyboard and on here. And then it's going to try to connect. There we go, finally. All right. Uh, so yeah, we're just gonna follow that parrot up just fine like normal. All right, so now that we've got it connected, uh, we don't even have to do the other method anymore. What I do is I just hit the microphone button and watch what happens. Open Chrome. Perfect. <laughs> So yeah, uh, we're in the internet now, and we can skip all of this stuff, and uh, yeah, I'm just going to go to rootjunkiesdl.com. As a matter of fact, yeah, that's the spot that you want to go to right there, but let's just do it the long way, uh, rootjunkiesdl.com, and um, yeah, I would have hosted this file on my internet, on my website, excuse me, but uh, I wanted this man to get the credit for his work, so you're going to go under apps and then you're going to look for something that says com.seeka 524 android quick shortcut that's one right there 2.02 megabytes let's update the permissions all of that good stuff okay yeah yeah and it won't let it scan okay so yeah we're still going to have to go to uh no, we don't have to do that. Let's try this. Open Galaxy Apps. Yeah, so it just opened it right up. Perfect. So now you're going to have to put in a Samsung account, which I'll be doing right now. 
um, but you're pretty much in the phone for the most part. Um, you're almost there, but you're going to need a file called ES File Explorer or an app called ES File Explorer rather. And let's just go ahead and download that. Both of those are the same apps. Usually the first app is always an ad, so that's why I'm showing that there. Yep, but I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to punch this in real quick. Um, yeah, I'll just cover it up in post editing. So y'all can see this is real. Let's do... All right, so once you get signed in and everything, you should be down you should be able to download the app. And bam. Perfect. All right, so there we go. We're going to go ahead and install that. Settings, we're just making it, you know, be able to read from unknown sources and then install. Excuse me. Yep, now we're gonna go. I usually let the list populate, but um, you're gonna look for the Google account manager, so we're gonna go into that. And you're going to look for the first one that says type email and password. There's two different ones. I just used the first one. And, uh, yep, we hit try. And then we hit our menu and go to browser sign in. This is what tricks the phone into, uh, well, not tricks the phone. It pretty much just puts that specific, you know, email into this phone. So now you can bypass it. Let's try. Perfect. Now we are in and we can just go back. Just keep going back all the way to the beginning. And we're going to proceed by hitting next. Some carriers that try to activate the phone right now, being that this is on Sprint, this is trying to activate it the Sprint way. Um, so yeah, we just wait for it to do its thing. Look. This ain't a phone. This ain't a phone. This is a note. This is a note. This is the last level of mobile devices. This all that she wrote. Yeah. I call it the GOAT. This be that hotness for show. Right. Everybody who got it, they know. Uh. And if you accidentally grabbed the fact it's simply that you slip fell on the pile of gold. Oh. I be racking up chests with my note. Yeah. Don't leave the office a desk with my note. I'm on deck with my note. Hey. And when it's time for handling business, I click on the pen and get it. And now I'm signing PDS with my note. Yup, yeah. yeah, this a go. Would I give it up? Heck to the no. Heard you really want the best, get a note. Competitors can't even stand next to the no. Look, I get it in with the pen, pressing and go. But wait a minute, you ain't so. How I kill him when I write with the screen off The slate just got white with a clean cloth Cause baby tell me who can write with the screen off That's the sound of me winning That's the sound of mean business Ask Alright, finally The account is added uh, So Now we're gonna try to bypass And you'll see what happens It can't pull nothing down yet Just wait. All right, finally. All right, so, uh, yeah, finally set up. You can skip all that crap now. Skip anyway. Skip all that crap. Finish. Yeah. And you're going to come across this. This is pretty much letting you know that you can't get into the phone right now because 
it knows something's up. Uh, you just can't do it. So all you have to do here, and you can see we're fully into the phone. Everything is going on just fine. But uh, yeah, all you have to do is just restart the phone. And uh, you should be in. Yep, we are in. Everything is golden. Uh, so yeah, that's uh, the keyboard method. Yeah, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment box. If the video helped you, hit the like button. If you want to see other stuff from your boy, subscribe to the channel or just browse through it. See what you like. If you like it, then subscribe to it. However you want to do it. But um, yeah, that's the keyboard method. And uh, links in the description about what keyboards work. Mm -hmm. that I've seen and if you as, as you guys add or let me know that other keyboards work I will add those in the description too